How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. So if you're looking for free VPNs for your Mac, well, I've got a couple of suggestions for you. These are completely free VPNs. Now, they do have limitations, but of course, you know, any VPN will come with a limitation. And I'll talk about some premium VPNs that you can use later if you're interested in a premium VPN. Okay, now as far as free VPNs, both Proton and TunnelBear are compatible with Mac, iOS, Android, uh, and most devices really. Now, the catch with Proton VPN, we'll start with Proton VPN. The catch with Proton VPN is that you only have three locations to choose from, and that'll be Japan, Netherlands, and the United States. But the cool thing is there are no bandwidth limitations, so you can use Proton VPN as much as you'd like. Of course, you can't download any torrents because they're just not allowed on the free servers. Now with TunnelBear, you have access to many more servers, but you only have three gigabytes a month. So this is the catch with uh, TunnelBear. Now with both of these VPNs though, you cannot torrent, you can't access streaming services, but as far as securing your data, they still work very well. But if you're not really willing to put up with the compromises here, and you'd like a premium VPN that works with streaming services, uh, torrenting, and fully secures your data and gives you all kinds of bonus features, then you're looking at more premium VPNs like Surfshark, NordVPN, and ExpressVPN. Now, these are not free, unlike Proton and TunnelBear, uh, but they do have 30-day money-back guarantees. And if you have an iPhone, you can use the seven-day free trial to try them out. Otherwise, you can download them on your Mac and utilize the 30-day money-back guarantee to use them. Now, let's talk about these three VPNs just to help you make a more informed decision in case you're interested. And so I've been regularly testing the best and most popular VPNs, and I've narrowed it down to Express, Nord, and Surfshark as the best three VPNs overall. Of course, they all vary in budgets and features, yet they all have a kill switch, they're excellent for torrenting, and they all consistently work with streaming services such as Netflix, Hulu, and Amazon Prime Video. And that's why these are my favorite three. But depending on your situation and preferences, one of them may be a better choice for you, and I'll explain why. Starting with ExpressVPN. And this is going to be the best one if you're looking for the best overall, fastest, and easiest to use VPN. And it has the most verified no locks policy, which was demonstrated through a real life stress test proving that they don't collect or track any user data. It has over 3,000 servers in 94 countries, which is a big number of countries, allowing you to access content from all over the globe. Plus, you can secure up to five simultaneous connections per account, and it's compatible with most devices. And so ultimately, whenever people ask us what the best most reliable VPN is and don't mind spending a few extra dollars to ensure the highest levels of reliability, ExpressVPN is my go-to choice for those looking for a premium VPN. Next up is NordVPN and Nord is what I consider to be the best value VPN. It has over 5,400 servers in 60 countries and while more servers does not necessarily mean better service, this can help with speed and latency especially if you use a VPN for gaming or if you want extra features such as threat protection which blocks ads malware ridden websites as well as protect your device from harmful files which is a neat little feature and so nord kind of gives you more options to fiddle with and that's where the value for the money comes from especially that it's about as fast as expressvpn in terms of performance and will let you secure up to six devices per subscription as opposed to expressvpn's five device limit so all in all if you're someone looking to have a few more options in your vpn then the NordVPN would be the one to get. And then finally, Surfshark is my best pick for the best budget VPN. And while it has all the essentials like Express and Nord, it's not quite as fast as those two. Although with Surfshark, you're allowed to virtually secure an unlimited number of devices with just one account. So it's a great option if you don't want any simultaneous connection limits. You also get over 3,200 servers in 100 countries, which is a lot. Also, you still get bonus features such as an ad blocker for for blocking pop-ups, two types of specialty servers, as well as no borders mode and rotating IP, which can be very useful if you're trying to use your VPN in a restrictive country. So ultimately, if you're looking to spend the least amount of money, but still have all the core features of a premium VPN, or if you need a VPN that allows you to secure all of your devices, or if you have a larger family, then Surfshark is the ideal choice. And so to sum it up, these VPNs are definitely the best in the business. ExpressVPN is a premium VPN with a 
strong emphasis on security and utmost anonymity and it's perfect for those that are privacy conscious and are looking for the best VPN overall. Now NordVPN is a well-rounded high performance VPN that offers a lot of value for the money and is ideal for those looking for bonus features that can be useful in a variety of ways besides base VPN functions such as strong encryption, secure torrenting and working with streaming services. And Surfshark is truly the best budget VPN that gets the job done without sacrificing any of the necessary security features that you usually get with more expensive VPNs. And as an added bonus, you get to share it around with as many of your friends and family as you would like, which is a great plus. And that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing and discounts in the description down below, as well as full reviews if you'd like to learn a little bit more about them. Comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.